let's go ahead and play it. Here we go. Ooh. So if there's any like videos, I'm going to, I think, take my beautiful face off uh, of the game. I'll put it on normal. All right. I think I gotta take my face off. X parasite. A gelatinous parasitic organism indigenous to the planet. Mm. X parasites were driven not by emotion, but by an instinctive need to replicate and spread to stronger hosts. Mm. Like the Metroids, they are believed to be extinct. Mm. Oh no. <gasps> oh no. Oh no. <gasps> with no Metroid surviving on SR388, it became infested with the X. Horrifying pets capable of imitating any living being. Unaware of this, I set foot on the planet, got infected, and almost died! Ooh. The only thing that saved me was a vaccine created from Metroid DNA, which also left me uniquely able to oppose the X. This ability was tested immediately when I went to a biological space laboratory's research station to investigate a distress signal. Ooh. Evil. There, I battled many powerful X forms, including the SAX which was the X mimicking me in my power suit at full strength. I eventually eliminated the X menace at SR388 by setting the BSL research station on a collision course with the planet. After that, the X and Metroids were just memories, or so we thought. Just when it all seemed over, the Galactic Federation received a mysterious video transmission. It showed an X alive and in the wild. Thorough analysis proved the video was real. Although the sender was unknown, the transmission was traced to a particular planet. It was called ZDR. If the X had somehow escaped extinction out there, they would pose a threat to the entire galaxy. The Galactic Federation dispatched a research team of seven Emmys to investigate. Is that an Emmy? That's an Emmy. An Emmy is a large research robot designed to capture field samples and extract their DNA. Their incredible mobility and productive planty, plating made of the strongest stuff in the universe practically guaranteed the mission's success. But not long after their arrival on ZDR, all communication was lost. What is happening on ZDR? Is the planet really infested with X? As the only one immune to the parasites, it's up to me to go there and find out.
soon be entering ZTR's atmosphere. Booty. She's hurt. Whoa. That elevator leads to the depths of an underground facility. Signal quality is likely to be low. Remote communication remains. Try to connect to the facility's network when you reach the bottom. That way, can you gain in contact? Any objections, please? I do like the outfit though, the colors. So I'm going to assume that like all of this just happened. What's up, Kugach? How you doing today, buddy? I can't even charge this up yet. ZL to slide. Ooh, bam. Oh, shit. YOLO. Yeah, what you up to today, buddy? Ammo at maximum capacity. Look at that. She even like puts her hand on that. How are you doing? Q Gatch? You out there gatching coos? <laughs> I don't know what that means. 
Hold R to ready missiles and press Y to fire. Some destructible blocks are hidden. If you run into a dead end, try shooting at your surroundings, striking some blocks with missiles. Uh, oh, there it is. I can open that one. Physical amnesia. Your assailant. I am checking the Federation database against your video lock. It appears to have been a chozo. The attacker's identity is not yet clear. I have determined that you are somewhere within the depths of CPR. Your top priority should be to return to your ship on the surface. This situation is precarious. precarious. Trust your instincts as you navigate upward. This planet appears to consist of multiple areas. Shuttles, elevators, and other modes of transport connect them. Keep an eye out for ways to reach the surface. The ship's location is marked on your global map. You may encounter pockets of low temperature. Your metroid DNA renders you vulnerable to such environments. Spending time in cold areas will be harmful to you. There are many such cold areas scattered underground. Do not enter them with your basic power suit. One final thing. Underground interference is preventing radio transmissions. Check in with me at any network stations you find. Wow, that was a lot of info. I will save it. <laughs> you've been waiting for chicken burger to cook in the oven and you've been gatching all day. Gatching them coos? I think I just came from that way. Yeah, I did. Uh, this is Metroid Dread. Wait, what did that say to me? Amiibo. Okay, pause and did. Yeah, this is Metroid Dread. Uh, it's on the Switch. It's been out for a while. I just had like other games I was playing. <clears throat> like Pokemon. Ooh. Use a melee counter at the right moment. Automatically take aim and they press X to use your melee counter now. Oh, damn. Well, that was what's up. Oh, yeah, I can't go in those yet. Um, no. You've never, um. You've never played um, Metroid on, oh shit, on the Super Nintendo? Okay, so I need to get good at that because that is just, damn it. Come on, buddy, try that again. Bitch. There we go. Uh, oh, these stupid bats. Um, no, so it's, um... God. Alright. Never noticed had a Sega. Oh, uh, okay, okay. So, um, the first one, I guess, came out on the NES, the Nintendo. And it was just called Metroid. What happened? If an area on the map is blinking, it indicates a hidden item is there. So... Hey. 
missile tank. So it came out, um... I guess I can't get back over there yet. It came out first on a Nintendo. Hold on. Oh shit. Can we kind of press X at the exact? <clears throat> oh my gosh! All right, press X at the exact moment of the flash. Oh shit! <laughs> yeah, that uh, is gonna be freaking hard. I'm gonna already undergo that. Jeez. I have the Omega Cannon now. Omega Blaster Online. Hold L to aim, tilt it to... If a target is nearby, Samus will automatically face that direction. Testing. So... Hold, hold R to charge it. Once charged, press Y. Wow. So I guess that's how I kill these things. Damn! <laughs> wow. That was, uh... I tried to hit X, but damn! back to the regular one. Okay, well, I already went in there. Interesting. Uh, yeah. So, I don't know if you're here still. You said you were gonna be back. Um, but yeah, so, Metroid first came out on the NES, and then they made Super Metroid for the Super Nintendo. Yes, I'll save it. And then... I don't think there was a... There, was, there weren't any Metroids on the N64. Oh, jeez. Um, but they did have... a Metroid on the GameCube. called Metroid Prime, which was like a first-person shooter. Alright, I'm a little confused, but... I don't think I can go under there, can I?
Okay. I was like, man, how am I gonna get up there? It's a wall. And then there were two Metroid Primes. There were a lot of Game Boy. There was like Game Boy Advance, and I, I mean there were other versions of the game. Just not on a like a main console, I guess. Because uh, there were some Game Boy Advance games. Uh oh. It's cold down here, I think. Yeah, it looks cold. Oh. Oh, no. This was on the trailer. Pretty sure. Run! Too big. <clears throat> so it couldn't find me, basically. Ooh, what is this? Nice. Save it. Or it's one of these. Talking to that guy. Uploading data. I'm gonna talk to the robot. Both any you encountered were clearly trying to capture you. They may have been hacked. If so, it's reasonable to assume all any will be hostile. Emmy, send out a calls to detect vibrations in the air within a certain range. Essentially, they can hear you. Ooh. Upon detecting vibrations. An enemy enters surveillance mode to track their source. Stay out of its line of sight when this happens. Otherwise, the danger to you increases dramatically. An enemy that has seen you will begin pursuit. Part of the pursuit protocol is to seal the enemy's own exits. You will be trapped inside. To survive, you must leave its range of pursuit. Evade the enemy and it will disengage. This will also unseal the exits. An enemy never leaves its assigned zone. Their control system must permit them to operate only within that range. I estimate a 99% probability of death if an enemy captures you. There Ooh. may be a very small opportunity to escape, but exploiting this window will be virtually impossible. The enemy are immune to your current weapons. You lack the unique energy used to defeat the first enemy. Your only option now is to evade capture and find an exit. Your highest okay. priority in an enemy zone should be simply to survive. Yeah. Nice. Makes sense. That guy was gonna kill me. So, I can get up here. Let me see what's over here. Oh. Sensor locked door. I don't think I can get that. Bam. Bam. Oh, I can't turn into the ball yet. Unless I can... Wee. Nope. <laughs> uh, I can do that, I guess. Okay. Man. Well, that sucks. At least I don't think I can go in there. Right? I can't go in there. Let's see if I could slide in there. Yeah, I think I gotta wait till I can turn into the ball. Maybe that's the ball right below me. That little demon thing holding it. It's in here, isn't it? Wait, let me go here. 
It's gotta be it. Oh. It's not it. Okay. Let's check down here. I can't go up there. Can't go there. Here? Maybe it's that one above me. Gracious. Oh, oh, I can go in here. What are these? Maybe this is one? No, can't go up there yet. Can't turn into a ball yet, guys. Hmm, okay. What is this, save? Yeah. I'll save it. Why not? Why not? Can't, ooh, energy tank. Oh, damn it. Damn it. <laughs> well, I was probably supposed to come down here anyways, so. Let's see what's in here. Anything? What are these? Let's just see what's down here. Probably nothing. Come on. Bam, there we go. Um, see, I can't go in there either, so it doesn't really matter. So, I, okay. I know I gotta come back here. Breathing underwater. Okay, yeah. Is this it? Is this where I get the ball? Maybe. Let's see what happens. Give me power. Give me power. Um, it's a map. Nice. Yeah, I'll save it. All right, so let's go this way. Um. Okay, so that's where... Oh, God, no, no! <laughs> oh, wait. Hold on, but well, what's up there? I feel like I need to go up here first. There we go. Yeah, see, something is up here. Bam. It's this missile. Nice. So, that's basically where I went from the first time. What is that? The question mark. Hmm. So, I can't go back up there. Or, no, because I think as soon as I come out of here, I'm going to... Pretty sure I gotta go back. Pretty sure. Okay, yep, and here. Back in the oh yeah. What the hell is that? It felt like I'd been here, but I guess I haven't been here. Water! Kill it! Oh, that's what I gotta do. Oh god, no! Oh god. 
Oh shit. Thought I thought I could go. Damn. <laughs> Those are hard to get. I mean to Hmm. I don't know why I thought I could avoid that. I think it saves it though, like pretty yeah. What the hell is that machine? That's what I don't know. Did it not go up enough? Oh shit. Here we go. Now I can go. Let's go. Alright. Um... Oh shit. This has to be the ball. Give me that ball. Give me the power. Maybe this is more health. It just, oh, it just gives me health. I don't think I can get up there yet. Let's see what's over here. What's down here? Hmm. Nothing that I can get to yet. Oh, this is... Oh, uh, okay. That's the area that's too cold. So I can't do that yet. Okay, wait. Are these not? Let's, uh, <clears throat> let's keep going this way. Um, maybe I go up there. I don't know. I feel like I can't go in there yet. No, I gotta go this way because uh, <laughs> I can't do the other way. Hmm. It's interesting. Okay, they're giving me a lot of missiles. Obviously, it's not in there. Maybe it is? No, because this was... Okay, this was that cold area. That's what the missile ones look like. Good to know. Mm. Ooh, here's a ball. What is it? Charge beam.
All right. Nice. Press and hold Y to charge and release fire. They deal da uh, damage enemies immune to normal beam, such as robots and bosses. They can also open charge beam doors. In addition, they can perform a charge attack by spin jumping when the beam is fully charged. Spin jumping. Hmm. It's about time. Ooh, what is this? Oh, I'm gonna probably use it, huh? Get out of here, little bitch. Two hits. Hmm. Wait a minute. Oh, I need to go in here. I need that. Give me that energy. How does it look nice? That's what I needed. That's what I needed. I can't. Yeah, I can't get up there yet. Okay. Die, motherfucker, die. Alright. Can I get up here? I can. Oh, I gotta get used to that still. Damn it. Give me that hell. Well. There we go. Yeah, give me all that. Um It looks like I've already been here. I have already been here, but now I can go in this room. I've been here too. Um, I don't know if I need to go this way. I feel like I don't need to go this way. Yeah. Yup. That was a waste of time. I thought. So this makes sense because. Save it. Oh, gotta get off soon, anyways. About 20 minutes. All right. Here we go. I can go here now. Except I can't get that yet. Damn. Oh. been to both of these doors. Let's go this way, yeah. But I can't get up there. Yeah. Charge station. Hmm. Oh, I think I gotta have that fast run, probably. If anyone thinks. They're gonna beat me inside that mall! 
and keep me from getting my kids Christmas presents. They can kiss my fat vagina, cause I'm bringing the motherfucking pain. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, well, thank you for the 50 bits to play that. Wow. I forgot how long that was. <laughs> yeah, I made... I was never sure how to price those. The ones that are more expensive are the longer ones. I need to double... I need to check that again. Yeah. Same. That's why when I like, I saw it on there, like someone made it, I was like, all right. I gotta put that shit on. Because that's hilarious. <clears throat> and then there's the... The Game of Thrones wiener song. And that one's like the full song, I think, so it's kind of long, so... All the long ones, I, uh... Oh, shit. I made him, like, more... ...bits, but I tried to, like, at first I made him... I think I lowered them all, because at first I made him, like... What was it, like, two... It was, like, a dollar, but then I was like, no, like, I'll make it, like... Because a ten bits is, like, ten cents. So I was like... That's not that bad, to play a sound. 50 cents isn't that bad. If someone wants to play it. <laughs> but I still don't know what to, you know, it's still a learning process of... ...trying to, um... ...find... ...things that... ...are fun, and like, actually like... ...worth it. Like, where it's like, not like... ...too expensive or anything crazy, you know? The thermal fuels flow has been redirected. You gotta try this one out. Which one is it? I mean, they're all from the show. Pretty much. Um, so... Oh. This is from fa This is from Family Guy. <laughs> it's so, so loud. <laughs> oh, that was it. It wasn't the full thing. Maybe that was. I need to double check that one. Cause see, yeah. Cause see, yeah. Okay, now I'm looking at the price. A dollar fifty. Which thank you by the way, for, cause that does go to me. I think I need to double check that. Cause, um, um. Yeah. There is no record of your assailant in the Federation database. However, there are records. It was pretty long. Warrior tribe. There is a strong possibility that you are connected. You have seen the Warrior Tribe's architecture and artifacts on this planet. I conclude that this was one of their settlements. But why would someone leave you here and send the Emmy after you? The footage of the ex parasite may have been staged to lure you in. The situation remains unclear, but your priority hasn't changed. You must return to the ship. You have activated the magma supply system that has restored power to the closed thermal doors. Seek them out to proceed. Continue to search for the unique energy you employed against the first enemy. It is the only way you can confront them. Unfortunately, this energy is limited. You may have noticed it dissipating after an enemy is destroyed. There are six remaining enemy hunting you. You have no means to confront them. Remember that. Nice. But yeah. 
Yeah, I need to make sure it's the full um, clip, though. Oh, thank you. Oh, are those like leftover biddies? Thank you for the bits. Open, open. Oh, you can come in here. Oh shit, I'm going down the dumps. Oh, I think I could have jumped over there. Now, where the hell am I? This is intense. Sorry if I'm not uh, reading everything. Right away. <laughs> I can't read it right now. Alright. Ooh, okay, something happened. Thank yeah, thank you for the bits though. I appreciate that. Am I destroying it? I mean, it looks like it's doing some damage. It's doing damage. There we go. Oh, damn. Oh, damn it. Got him. Uh oh, he's coming. Oh, I think I gotta destroy this one. Shit. Yeah, I got my thing charged. Oh, God. fight this guy. You're welcome, Felt. See, I don't know why it's not coming up, too, with the chat. for you over here with just me to keep you company. <laughs> nah, don't worry about it, man. I appreciate it though. Yeah, I need, I want to check I want to check that out because now I want to like make sure it's the full length because if someone's going to pay a dollar 50 I don't want it to be not the full length. 
because that's that's money, you know. Um. <clears throat> All right. So, where is this dude? Yeah, but what am I... I know that. There he is. Oh, God. Break it off. Bam! Oh man, that was scary. Woo! Nice. Give me energy. What did I get? Suit upgrade? What? Spider magnet. Huh. Yeah, I don't know how the viewers thing. Oh, I can attach to blue walls. Nice. And there's more. Oh, there's no more over here, though. Yeah, I don't know the viewer thing. Like, I'm not really exactly sure. Um, you know, because, like, sometimes I think it's a little delayed. But sometimes, you know, it's good. I've been here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then the, well, the the mods, I guess, are like the Moobot and stuff like that. So that one's awesome. Um. There we go. Oh, but I can't get in there. Okay, but I can go over here though. Wait. How do I? I can't go in there. Oh, yes I can. But yeah, so what do you got going on today, Kugach? Kugach? <laughs> no. What do you got going on today, though? Because I probably, since you... Talking about sandwiches, I need to make a sandwich. Oh, damn it, I can't go in there. I need to eat soon. Okay, I can't go this way yet. So, oh, probably up here. There we go. But yeah, now I'm thinking about it. Like, I want to make. I know I keep talking about it. I just want to make sure. It's, um, the full audio. And I feel like the only way to know if it's the full audio is to go to, um, YouTube. And watch the video and see if it's as long as the audio.
Invisible monster. Bam. Use that missile. So I think that's a hint. Oh, damn. Maybe it's not a hint. So I can only... There we go. Sorry, I'll read your comment in a second. <laughs> oh God. It's like, let me turn invisible, but just have a big sh uh, like flashlight. What the heck? His foot. Oh, I missed it. That's, that's hard to do. I'm not used to that yet. Um. Okay, so I can just... <clears throat> there we go. Ooh! Get him! Oh, that was... I'm so confused. So I could have been shooting him the whole time? I thought it was like a video. Goodness gracious. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Come on. Shoot some of those balls out so I can get health. <laughs> I think I fall. I think I got him. Look at me just walking away like a badass. Uh oh. Nice. Finish him. Ooh. What is that? 
Phantom Cloak acquired. That is what's up. Uh, nothing much now for the rest of the day. You just had lunch. Gonna have a drink and do some of the South Park event before watching Haze later. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm, I need to do... Ooh. Upgrading suit for Aeon compatibility. Nice. An Aeon ability... <clears throat> I think I'm saying that right. Renders Samus invisible to en enemies by refracting light. She can also move silently, albeit at a slower speed. With full Aeon, press... R to activate, press it again to deactivate. It'll be slowly consumed while this ability is activated. Moving or firing uh, will consume. Once it has been depleted, the Phantom Cloak will consume energy instead. Should it deplete energy to one, it will automatically deactivate. After deactivation, it'll begin to recharge. Once once Samus makes any actions, the ability cannot be activated again until the Aeon is full. Hmm. Um, let me see. Nothing much now. Oh, yeah. So I haven't even done the event. I haven't started. Um, I was debating on streaming it. I usually do. But I was like, you know, I haven't played this game. I want to play it. I just... I was streaming Pokemon a lot. And I kind of finished Pokemon. Like, kind of. I don't, is this the right way I should go? I need to get a save station. I can't even go here anyway, so... Can't go down here either. Oh! So that's how I get through these. Okay. Because I wanted to go up. I'll go up. Because I need to go to that save station. Um... They're pretty sweet graphics. Uh, this is on the Nintendo Switch. Uh, and it's just a new game. Um, it is it's not a remake or anything like that. They did remake a Metroid game for the, the 3DS, um, which I played. It was a good game. Um, I need to save it. Can I go up there and save it? I don't know where I'm going. Um, I just haven't... Yeah, I think I can go here. I just haven't played it. Until now. I think that yellow area is a save. Yeah. Okay. Let me see. But I do like the graphics. Yeah, it's on the Switch though. Oh yeah, I, need to, I think I know what's wrong with the chat bot. The chat box. So I will um, leave it and save it here. It's a decent spot. And I need to make a sandwich and stuff as well. Uh...